you sweat through the sweatshirt? Or is that yeah, just... it's, it's hot. It's a struggle, but <laughs> I love it. I can't understand. I mean, I know why you guys are doing it, but that's yeah. just that's tough, man. It's tough the first twenty minutes before you, once you start sweating, you get uh, you get cold. Mm-hmm. You're all wet. Good deal. What are your thoughts on being named captain? You're you're not one of the more vocal guys, but you're one of the hardest working guys. Mm-hmm. You think it's sort of a recognition of how much time you put into your game? Um, yeah, I think it is. It's just an honor just to be able to represent the team as a captain and. Um, knowing that my teammates view me as a leader and see me as a captain, so I'm just I'm just honored to be viewed by my teammates like that because that's the main thing I'm to I care about is how my teammates view me and my work ethic. Do you think it may prompt you to be a little more vocal this season? Uh, yeah, I think I picked up being bo- more vocal over the off season just because my role and um, how I had to be. So I think my vocal skills have gotten a lot better and. I think leading by example is probably still the best thing for me to be able to do, and, but I'll, I'll pick up both for sure. A lot of position groups had a lot of turnover this offseason. Secondary, a lot of most mm-hmm. guys are back. What's that right. advantage being, like having everybody back? And- I'm just adding more stuff. We were able to add more disguises, able to add more, just more IQ to the whole defense. So we're able to play a lot more, a lot looser, and just being able to be on all of our, our assignments, uh, just better every single play. And, um, just getting better and just being more versatile with, with what we, we can do. We were asking uh, Jalen about uh, how a coin can disrupt the passing lanes a little mm-hmm. bit and maybe cause the QBs to put a little more air on the ball. You guys yeah. like that back there? Yeah, a lot of more overthrown balls because he's so long. He can get his hand up, get more PBUs, or just give us some air time to get to a ball to get under it for the, for the interception. Um. A lot of what GA has been preaching is forgetting about last year, even though you guys had so much success. Mm-hmm. How easy is it to just forget about last year and really move on to focusing on what you guys can improve on? Um, I think it's pretty easy just knowing that we did well, but we didn't do as well as we wanted to. There's a lot of stuff we left on the table, so we know this year we have to do a lot better to be able to be the best secondary in the country because that's our goal. Yeah, we don't want to be so short or anything less than that. Have you had a chance to um, observe the, the three New freshman DBs very much, Craig and, and Miles and um, not much on the field because we're two days in. Yeah. And over summer we weren't um, really working out with them much, but in the film room they're asking a lot of questions. So I know that they're they're hungry to, to learn and just get better mentally because that, that's where it starts. If you don't know where to line up, and it's it's gonna be really tough for you. So I see all three of them. They're they're really in in the in their um, in the notebooks, really taking good notes and asking a lot of questions. So that's the best thing I see out of them so far. Shout out, Kevin. <laughs> Thanks, Kevin. Awesome. Thanks, Thanks, Kevin. Thank you, guys. Appreciate it. Appreciate it.